Hey what's up you guys, it's me again, Momo, and today I'm going to be showing you my Magical Girl haul that I promised I would show you guys and you guys voted a yes for to show you on Instagram. If I have the poll, I'll put it up here, but I don't think I do. Okay, so I, a little backstory. I struggle in school, not like grade wise, but anxiety wise and uh, it was really bad for me this year. This time was hectic. Um, so I decided to treat myself because I haven't treated myself also in like years because <laughs> I have a lot of anxiety when it comes to money. But this time I went ham. <laughs> so I want to like make this really quick because I bought a lot of stuff and I might even miss stuff. So as I'm editing, if I remember something that I missed, I will show you guys. Most of this stuff is Tokyo Mew Mew because I went on like a rampage of finding rare items and I have one item that I am just, I cannot believe that I have. So let, let's just get started, stop talking. All right, so first thing I got was this adorable Tokyo Mew Mew notebook. And if you look over here, this is like a little Ichigo bookmark. I don't know if you're able to see that. Look how cute she is. And she has like an open flap. So you can just put her in between, I guess, any book page. But I think it's meant for this. And you can just stick her in there. But even the inside of the book is very adorable. Um, I don't know why I'm not focused on it. That's how the notebook looks on like all the pages. It's like a graphed notebook. And then the front has the Cafe Mew Mew. Uh, if you guys watched Tokyo Mew Mew, it has the menu of the Cafe Mew Mew place. And I think that's so cute. What does the back have? Oh, the back has like a little calendar. Also, when I bought this, it came with this adorable Tokyo Mew Mew um, like gift bag of Mew Ichigo. And then if you turn her around, you have all the Mews. That's so cute. Also, sorry about my hair. Sorry about the minimal makeup on it. I wanted to do like a magical girl hair. Should have just gone with the Odangos and shut up. But I'm also wearing my card captor Sakura. Or card captor Nyakura or something. What was it? <laughs> sure. Next, I bought. Okay. I bought. Oh god. There's a lot. So I bought this. They're enamel pins. Tokyo Mew Mew enamel pins. There's still some that I wanted that were missing from this batch, but it came with these, and then it came with these. I hope you can see that. And then it also came with these, and they're just enamel pins. Um, I did sell some of them. I'm still selling like three other ones that I don't really want. Uh, it's on my Etsy shop, if you guys want to check it out. I'm selling the Aoyama, Miu, uh, Miwa, and Moe, and one of the lettuce ones. So if you're interested, go grab them before they're gone. Okay, so I'm not going to open this. But, I got this stationery set, which I think is adorable. And it's just a pen with Mew Ichigo dangling from there. I love that. Um, and then a file folder in the back and a little um, like sticky notes, but I don't think they're like sticky. I think they're just like a notepad that just rip off. And next, I'm not gonna open this up either. But I'm gonna like put a picture of it somewhere if I can find it. I want to hang this up by my figures on top of my figures. Um, in this tube, there is this poster. Insert if I have a picture of it somewhere. And I freaking love it. Next, I have. Oh, okay. This is like my only Shugo Chara um, item. Is it Shugo Chara or Shugo Kara? I don't know because I know Kara like character, but Chara would be like the way you would pronounce it in Japanese, no? Anyways, I found this Etsy seller 
who is selling these adorable acrylic charms. Um, I will put her Etsy shop or artist name either in the description or on here somewhere. Oh my god. And I also got a, a Sakura eating a strawberry. And I love this bow. So much. I think it's adorable. She also had one of Tomoyo eating the same strawberry. It, it's like it would it would act as a set. I didn't have enough money, but I did order a Mew Ichigo one, which is insert picture here. I'm still waiting for it to come in. And then eventually I will buy Tomoyo because I mean you gotta buy the set. You can't just buy one of them. She needs her friend. So next I'm going to show you guys um the figures and I have like keychains that I have like balanced out somewhere so I, I don't want to move them plus I don't want to break them so I'm gonna take you along and we're gonna look at the figures that I got so if the audio is different it's because I had to unplug the mic in order to move the stuff so let's go okay so first off I have this adorable beautiful card capture sakura figure i always wanted a sakura figure and i think this one is the prettiest i think this one fits more my aesthetic and i love how it's based off the manga and i just love how extra big it is it is huge you guys like this wings won't even fit on the screen so when i got this i bought this from another seller who was selling her without her box unfortunately but he was selling her for 70 dollars and i said okay but the thing is, he wrapped it well, I guess, but this part of her club card broke, so the wing falls off and everything. I don't want to touch it, but um, I contacted them, and eventually they gave it to me for free. So I got her for free, didn't spend anything with her. I love her. I love her frills and everything. So that's Sakura. I have a Tokyo Mew Mew Lika doll. And Lika dolls, if you don't know, are basically like Barbie dolls. So this is Lika, or Barbie I guess, um, dressed up as Tokyo Mew Mew, Mew's Ichigo. And she does have a tail, if you can see right there. <laughs> so cute. And then it's unopened, so I don't know if I want to open it or not, haven't decided. Um, and then right on top of her, I have washi taped on there, um, so it doesn't damage the box. I have a Mew Ichigo rubber keychain that I have been looking for for so long along with other keychains that I still can't find. I think this is adorable! I love it so much! I know they have ones of other characters but I can't find those either and I am looking. I am searching. So if you find one or find someone that's selling it please let me know in the comments or just DM me on Twitter. <laughs> Alright moving on I have this Mew Ichigo mini figure it's very tiny it came with um i think it was like a ps4 or something um box and there was one of mew mint as well um kind of want it but i don't know i'm i'm also content with mew ichigo because she's my favorite but i also really love mint so she's really tiny she's very fragile she'll fall apart very easily if you're not careful with her but I mean she's very cute nonetheless sorry it keeps going out of focus I'm not sure why all right next it's this adorable Mew Ichigo keychain that I've also been looking for and finally found um, it looks really bad in the glare but I think it's so cute she's holding a strawberry oh that's better she's holding a strawberry that says Tokyo Mew Mew and I, I think her chibi form is adorable so there's that one and then I have this lovely, lovely Madoka sitting down, looking so cute. I actually got a commission based on this pose and everything. I will insert it right here. And I think it's so cute. I love it so much. I saw a lot of people selling theirs. Not sure why. I think this is adorable. It's very innocent. It's very cute. I love the frills. I love everything about this figure. I think it's adorable. I just don't understand what her hand is doing. I, I don't, I, is that supposed to be like Satan or something? Because that's not very magical, baby. Um, <laughs> anyways, 
Next up, I'm guys, I'm saving the like best for very last. Next up is this creamy mommy figure. I think she is so beautiful. I have a funny story about this. Um, so the seller, I bought this off Bai Yi or Yahoo Japan, and the seller was selling her along with a different figure, and I wanted this one specifically with her holding her wand. And it's very hard to find this pink version of her holding her wand, but I managed to find it, but the seller was selling two things with it, and I just wanted the one. I messaged him and asked him if I can have only the one, and you can't directly communicate with them, you have to go through Bai, who sends them the message and translates it for them. And he said okay, but he accidentally deleted the post, and then he reposted it and is like, to the person who wanted to buy this, he like put like an announcement on there. I'll show you like pictures if I still have them, but it's so funny, I took screenshots, I thought it was so cute. And then she comes with, I don't know if you can see that, she comes with a little posy that just kind of sits there. She doesn't have like a peg that she sits on. Um, I love posy. Posy is my favorite. And then let us, oh my gosh, let us see the final thing that I cannot believe I have. Oh my gosh. I have this Mew Ichigo, perfect figure Mew Ichigo figure. I'm actually going to give you guys a better look at this because I'm so excited that I have it. Give me one second. Here she is. Look how beautiful she looks. She's holding her little strawberry bell. Oh my gosh. I mean, the accuracy. I'm also not a big fan of big bases, but her base isn't big at all compared to the other figures that I have. I'm, I'm just, oh my god. And if you turn it around, look at that hair, beautiful. Look at her bow, beautiful. And then you get a little shot. <laughs> I can't believe I have her. She was one of the priciest figures that I've ever bought, um, just because of how rare she is. I have been looking for this figure for so long, it's insane, and now she is up on eBay for like $800 plus shipping, I think, and I'm just like, yikes. Good morning to you. Yeah, anyways, and I'm just like, yikes, so I'm so glad that I got her when I did. Literally, like a week after I bought her, she got up for $800. I bought her for way less than that, and the seller who sold her to me was very sweet. He said he was like, you must really love this figure and you know, I'd rather give it to someone who really loves it and would cherish it than just keep it in my storage and everything. And I was really happy and very thankful. So, um, and then he gave me like some Marie Kondo thing that he learned from and I think it was so like very, very precious. Um, yeah, and I think that's it. I also bought a bunch of Magical Girl stuff at uh, Anime Central this year, so if you didn't see that video haul, go check it out because there's a bunch of Tokyo Mew Mew there as well and other nostalgic anime um, like Creamy Mommy. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If I forgot anything, I'll be sure to insert it as I'm editing. So this is the poster. Sorry, I'm recording on my phone. But this is the poster that I was talking about that I didn't want to take out of the packaging, but I finally did. And here it is. It's kind of like an advertisement poster where it's saying um, July 17th the video rental I guess comes out and then I don't know something about the DVD on August 21st um, and here is my little collection by the way here's how I have them set up uh, and then I hung charms up here and this is the charm that I was talking about that I had to buy or was coming in and I have to buy Tomoyo because I have because I have the Shibokara and uh, Sakura. I do have a few empty spots there, but that's because next to Rin, I have to buy Len, and then next to CL, I just got Sebastian. So I'm gonna put him up there. Uh, and yeah, I did hang the charms with tape. You can clearly see it through the phone camera. But I promise, you really can't see it without a camera, but <laughs> uh, yeah, that's how my little collection looks. 
Don't forget to check out my Etsy shop, please. I have new items on there. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media. Everything is linked in the description. I would really appreciate it so much. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.